scale, ambition, collaboration. Community, innovation and support. Ambition, legacy and the quality. A collaboration is not a, it's not a deed, it's a thought, it's a philosophy. It's not uh, a normal building that you're building, it's the future of science and for me there's nothing more rewarding that sometime in my future seeing AstraZeneca's new discoveries with the little that uh, Mace and myself we contributed in this facility. The quickest we've seen science activated in Ashley of this magnitude tends to be at least 12 months and it looks like AstraZeneca have activated science activities within six days of completion. It's a game changer for the industry. Labs of this magnitude are rarely built. You know, half a million square foot of laboratory space in one space um, is unique. The most exciting part is being part of a project which will have a lasting legacy. Being this my, my first full-time job and my first experience of a project and of a client, being able to work for such a prestigious client in a very unique sector in life sciences, I got to get a real feel and appreciation for quality. The back end of this project has really been about the people, how they've behaved, how they've interacted with us as a company. Uh, and I can't speak highly enough of that as a process. To see the reaction, the first impressions of those people moving into the building, the way they've enjoyed the building, the way that they've interacted in the building, it has been, for me, probably the reason why I do the job. Bringing this facility, which was a concept, into the facility that it is right now, as you can see, 18 labs with a client that is happy with the product. For me, I think this is why I love doing what I do. What I think was really genuine about it and really authentic about the collaboration is just rec that recognition. That any and all opportunity to engage early with the space in the building and to be able to create working knowledge of the thing that's coming our way. Um, we pushed into that conversation openly, authentically. We recognised that in some cases that will bring risks to parties, bring challenge, might even bring cost. Um, but if we lined up behind this common objective that it's about first science, then you know a lot of that was, well, that's then insignificant, isn't it? Let's just get on with it and do the right thing. There's usually very distinct teams between the project and the final end users or scientists. And what we've been able to do is work with those scientists, bring them around their facility, show them their facility early, and be able to make certain changes to it to enable it to be ready and fit for purpose. And that's what I would define as tenant liaison, working with those uh, scientists along the way to make sure that we deliver that facility at the standard that they require. For me, I think leaving this project, I think it's that collaborative, transparent approach between myself as Mesa's representative and the client on the next uh, project that I work in. It's making sure that we bring those two units because once we and the client work together, then um, the project uh, gets delivered. It doesn't matter what challenges uh, you come through. Anything is possible, born out of strong relationships. I'd like to think our relationship with AstraZeneca is here to stay. It's, it's wonderful to see it with people in it, with people with smiles on their faces, and the feedback so far has been brilliant. Um, I don't feel like it's my home. I feel like it's their home, and that's cool, because that's what it was for, right?